probably putting the books on the shelf the first day. Mm -hmm. That is my fondest memory, being here, putting the books on the shelf with the knowledge that I'm going to serve the community. That's it. This is a work of mission for me. Um, it's not a profit point. It's a service to the community. And I am gratified and I'm satisfied that we have done that for 28 years. And so it's bittersweet, but I'm ready to say bye. I've seen a number of kids in here today who are uh, three years old, five years old, and they're reading. And that gives me hope for the future because we have too many in their late teens and early 20s who are not reading. So when I saw the kids in the front, uh, one three-year-old who loves books, held on tightly to a book, uh, knew the name, could read the name of the book. When I see the five-year-old who can turn the pages and read the story to me, it makes my heart warm. It gives me confidence in the future for Milwaukee. Um, I feel good. The importance of books and what we learn from them is something that unfortunately is taken for granted a little too much. Um, but having the option of Reader's Choice these last 28 years, I know for many of us with children, has allowed us to be able to show a more diverse reflection of themselves um, to our children. And for those of us who have that hunger for knowledge and information, it was always great to come in here and have a conversation with you to recommend what our next book should be. Um, uh, of choice and for local authors to get the exposure that they needed uh, for the works that, they, that they've that they done. Um, so your work um, in this community um, will sorely be missed. And I just, on a personal note, I want to say this. I don't know if you know this one, Allison. A couple of years ago, I wanted to do a read-in for little kids at the library. So I was in here shopping for some books for my own child, and I had like a 30-minute conversation with you, and you told me about the National African American literacy month and all of that kind of thing. So now I think I'm on my fourth year of the Black History Month reading that I do the week of um, the national thing um, in, a, in partnership with the library. And that is solely because of you. Um, I w it would not be something that is an annual event that we do with tons of kids every year had it not been for you. Yeah.